and now we're gonna have Game and Watch or Are you guys gay? Doing Game and Watch or no? Looks like they're just striking right away. So I know that, you know, Zero Suit Samus is gonna like Zero Suit slaps, dude. <laughs> Zero Suit, that's the slap character. She's got so many good cross-ups, it's insane. Especially with uh, RB uniquely used. A lot of Zero, Zero Suit has one of the best movements in the game yeah. with just running speed, force fastest, good airspeed, uh, fast jumps, you know. And yeah, that too. Her, I believe it's her forward roll, her back roll is a standard. Her forward roll is a standard. Yeah, so I think it's like Lucario level or, yeah, or maybe something like the yeah. ass. I know it's a lot of like Zero Suits, they'll do, they'll jab someone's shield and then they'll roll behind cross up and start down smashing. A lot of zero suits do it. So that's one thing you're gonna do. I don't know if he's gonna do it. Is it really well, yeah, I think they're going straight into it. Okay. See, I don't, I have, I don't see me do it much because it gets predictable. But I mean, it could get flat. So right now we're just gonna see how the item game plays out. You know, Toronto Joke collected some, some of the items, but B seems to have them all under control now. Throws one off. Joe should just take control of the items. I hear you, because, I mean, while they're on there, you can use them to further edgeguard, you what know, I think Joe's too. doing is defending the edge of the pieces and trying to, like, um, use it as bait. Ah, okay, so that yeah. way, if you want to five, gets up a little more aggressive with the coach is getting back in the edge. A little impatient, so he can, so as you see, caught up with that. Now no. the pieces piece just dissipated on themselves. Ooh, that, wow. that's a lot of damage. Oh, well, could have been more of a... <laughs> so a little bit about this matchup, uh, as far as I know. Uh, I know that I give uh, the practice in this match as well. Because basically, you know, as Meta Knight, you're, you have a better ground game than Zero, so you know, you have longer range, you know, tilts, and we're talking about down tilts and forward tilts, of course. Yeah. But with Zero Suit, the side B and the down smash, you know, they do outrange uh, Meta Knight's tilts, however, they're just slow. You know, a little slower. What Meta Knight wants to do to get around moves such as that, he wants to do an overhead that, you know, to beat the down smash of Zero Suit. So things like Tornado, you know, kept cover is yeah. good airspeed and stuff you can reach over there. And we'll see if uh, Joe can apply this knowledge. It seems to be doing alright, but I don't know, he's still he's losing by a lot. All it takes is one side to get this one through an upper. Oh man, he, that was a good choke. Yeah, I waited for the air dodge. He waited the air dodge by jumping up and just cleaning the temple. You know, Meta Knight with uh, six jumps, you should be... Other options you could take, just jump away. You know, wait until... People get scared, the turning nerves come. Ooh, that was some. That was three o'clock DI. You that know, schools out right there. That was terrible. So yeah, a lot of the cute things with Zero Suit Sam is that she can use her up smash and her up B as platform pressure on the stage, and it's a decent, you know, attack. It's a disjointed hitbox. Sorry. Um, and so basically, it just it's it's safe. Is what it comes down to. You can do the Salem. The down B and then you edge cancel it. It's right, really and then you get bad. the back air. Yeah. And right now we just saw so Zero Suit can force an air release on Meta Knight. Meta Knight having one of the worst air releases in the game. And can she it, do anything out of it? Dash attack? She can dash attack, dash attack she can up, up air. Can up air is the killer. No. A low percent, you low know, percent when, when you get the combo, right? Because you can set up dash attack uh, strings across the stage, yeah? And she, yeah. You can dash attack, dash attack up. Up or um, up so long as they don't SDI right away. Yeah. So usually they only go for one dash attack. But um, we'll go for it. Now, Joe's using a good example of the tilt game. I think instead of trying to poke, he should have just opted to get the positioning and just go for the full tits, tilt when he did confirm. And I just I don't know if either Zero Suit is light or if uh, Zero Suit is SDI. Zero Suit is very light. He's one of the lightest characters. Now, also, when B105 had the grab right there, he had a kill set up. It was like, Meta Knight was not going to go into the platform, but B let it drop, so... I remember what uh, said earlier, um, there's a question actually, can Zero Suit or throw chain grab Meta Knight? No. She can only it's, space, right? So you can do it to Donkey Kong as well. I saw Nick Riddle versus, Will? versus uh, yeah, Will, and, I mean... It's, it seems that you know you need to have a certain amount of fall speed. From what it yeah. seems, I'm not yeah. going to say that I fully you know research the character, yeah. but yeah, it's that's what it seems. Ooh. 
other things to note in this matchup, though. This is exactly where V oh. wants to be. Here's the grab release now. Dash attack up tilt now. Yeah, so... I guess try to get the eye down. So, other things that, uh, in this matchup that are good to know. Um, Zero Suit's 4 frame up air does outrange Meta Knight's down air. Yeah, so you can't down air. In, mm, yep. I, no, I don't think DDD. DDD the yeah, hammer? It outranges DDD. It outranges everything. Wow. Because I know that uh, all of Mars up air also outranges every down uh, every, every down air approach, except for DDDs though. Because DDDs does have a range, even if you have a yellow, you can't you can't get it. In. What, ha what happens with DDDs on against all Mars? Is the hitbox is flashing. Yeah, that it's it's your score. Same thing with Sonic Corridor against Meta Knight's Pro Rush. Ah. I hit Meta Knight's Pro Rush before it hit mine. Oh, interesting. I was watching Challenge Drill Rush before. This is the exact same thing, except it's hurting. <laughs> but with Zero Suit, it's just one single hit box. Oh, that was... You could have got the damage, but... Yeah, you don't oh, really have an bad. option out of... The down smash, that almost killed me. And now this is really close. Oh, and there it is. Fear versus side B is so slick. Oh, I don't want to play losers' pools all tired and stuff. <laughs> I know that, um... You know, I think it's interesting to see that somebody else uh, in the scene has risen up and can now, you know, hang with, you know, Joe and myself. Uh, yeah. It's, uh, it, it's in my opinion, it's a little refreshing. Um, obviously, it gives me the option of not having to play Meta Knight, which is a bad match, right? You know, that's why I want to play it. And, but other than that, you know, he came in relatively new. He's only been here for about a year. I and the back when you just Bracket against Poker, and he was losing yeah, amateur bracket awesome. against uh, what's his name, uh, the Luigi player. Oh man, I can't remember. But he, he not Zap, uh, Poison Mist. Yes, yes, yes. He got second in the amateur bracket. This was literally last year in June. So and now yeah. look at him, the MJG. That's a big win. MJG's mm. a top player. You made top. You made what? You made um, top six in Dallas. You can he does. He does. Five. He does relatively well in the Midwest. Um, he did get placements, I believe, like 33rd at uh, SK Tar. So, I mean, I don't know if I'd say he's a top player. Like, you know, Nairo, Vinny, DeBuzz, that's like, Rich that's, Brown. That's beyond top player. That's beyond top player. <laughs> I, okay, I that's see your terminology now. Yeah. Okay. But um, he certainly is, it's you know, well better known. than most. Well known. He's better than nine. I'd say he's better than about 85, 90. Okay. That's it. That's it. So just for just so I can understand your perspective, where would you put people like you know Rich Brown or DHF or Tyrant or Vinny, Mewtwo King, and them ally? Maybe, maybe the top like five. percent Maybe the top five percent. Yeah, okay. okay. And that should be a kill. That's definitely. Oh well. We'll see more of that later. Now you see, Zero Suit's down B is transcendent. You know, so if you're trying to hit it with an up B, it's not gonna. You just all you have to do with that move. It just shield it and punish the future lens. But everyone tries to challenge that hitbox. I don't know yeah. why. I don't know why people do it, but people do it and they get hit and it feels stupid. So proper gimp from Joe right there. Oh, 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 oh. He's getting. You, you see, I'm surprised the. The hitbox. The... Well, just, I'm surprised that, I guess you could say the Meta Knights in our scene, namely Joe and. Yeah, I mean, namely Joe, I guess. Um, doesn't go to things like Delfino when people ban Frigate. Joe should have just held on the ledge. That's okay. Like, if he held on the ledge there when he double down B, right. he had no second jump, all he could do was up B and pull him down. Right. That would be a 0% stock for 182% stock. Big trade. Like, yeah! Just, just, just got up. But Joe seems to have some excellent... Oh no! He probably input the B early, so that he tried to up B probably and just got the end. You know, Zero Suit has a lot of quick combos, he has down tilt quick up air. A lot of te tech skill reliant. There's a lot of turning doors to do. Tech skill starts to fall through. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You know, moves that can go through Tornado. Side B can go through a, a more or less grounded Tornado. And Down Smash can go through it as well. So you have to have your Tornado in the air a little bit. The Pivot Grab can also go through Tornado as well. So now, excellent movement from V. You know, starting to make a comeback.
but Joe has stage control right now, and Joe's being a little bit more of a patient game. Uh, not to say that he wasn't before, but it's just it's more it's on slowing, point. He's slowing it down, he's making B play at a slower pace. That's what he's doing. He's slowing the right. down and making B play slower, right? He's usually all over the place, and right now it's just really slow. He's like, he needs a kill, I'm just going to set the pace of the match and play how I want to play this game. That should have been enough to punish after the data. But yeah, I hear what you're saying, you know, it's, uh, he's definitely out of control of this match. Oh, and that's There's the spot back where back it, back it, you can get the back air as an overhead on the NATO. Yeah, because you hit the, the center, the right. top center. A lot of characters can do stuff like that, but I think there's a lot more effect than that. Now, if you're playing a Zero Suit and you want to, uh, and she down tilts you, some of her options, she can read an air dodge and get a down smash off you. That's where she can capitalize off the most damage. She can get a forward air off of you, or she can go for an up air, depending on, you know, if you're a fast floor, if you're, if, if you're a fast faller, or if you're close. Now so... That, now that V doesn't need to build, it's going great. Right. It's going, it's going you nuts. You move it. Reverses, it's going, it's going and Joe has... Joe had good control of the tilt over there. He yeah, doesn't. He hit him out of the second jump. Right. So we're likely going to see a counter pick to FD, unless Joe bans it. In which case... Oh, he banned Halberd. He banned Halberd. Waiting for V's counter pick right now. And it is FD. He, Joe did ban Halberd. I guess the early kills. Well, it's very common from. It's very common from V because he takes a lot of Meta Knights here. I'm not sure what the Meta Knights have been banning this whole time. Not to say that, you know, they shouldn't ban FD per se, like Halberd. I can understand why you'd want to ban him. Like but, um. He's gutting the stage a lot. Oh, and Joe tried to be... Joe tried to go in. <laughs> but, you know, oh, uh, unfortunate trip, you know. Yeah. Excellent, excellent pressure with the suit pieces. See, he's keeping the suit pieces in. Okay, he's kept these pieces for so long. The oh, what was... The pieces, bait, the what a bait! About, the greatest thing about the pieces is if you're near them, they can't grab you. Exactly, and, uh, great. They're bouncing over, he can't NATO. He, he has can, excellent control. He, he can throw them up, go in, Hit him into the piece and then get another follow up out of that piece. It's, it's nothing you can do with pieces. If you're in between Zerus and Samus and the piece, oh, get the ready piece. to get, you know. Meta Knight with a piece of scary. Just imagine this Meta Knight with a projectile. There you go. Right. You know what I'm saying? But it doesn't matter. Wow. Okay. He's got his double piece, though. Oh, he doesn't. Wow. I thought he had the double piece. That is huge. That's big, though. Oh no, V, don't over. Oh, then that should be a kill. This is why, like I said, no platforms to mess around with stuff. Right. You get the grab release. And now Meta we have Knight, an on Smash. Meta Knight excels on platforms very well. Mm -hmm. So. Oh. oh the trip nice combo. Well. You got the trip on the down for well. I think V's trying to. He's, he's playing he's not, not reactionary enough. You know, he's not using his reaction. He's trying, he's trying to, to predict. He's trying to. Trying to use options against Joe's options. He's like trying to use Meta Knight's options to use non Meta Knight's options. You gotta help play Meta Knight. You can't see Toad Toad. I'm a little bit of zoning, but it looks like six. Oh, here we go. Nice. He can get a chain grab. He goes for the damage. Nice. Oh. Oh. Nice. Excellent. Oh, wow. Wow, he's getting in. <laughs> that was the gimmickiest thing, but it was. Wow, he just, he went in and he literally got, he, he was, Joe was at 40. And he just got the, wow. I think he said, he, he was at 75 to 40. He only took 10% while Joe took, you know, 80. Oh, what's with this DI from the set so far? Oh, he, Played, I should have beat him. Oh. <laughs> yeah, 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 shoulda, woulda, coulda, so, but... I was ahead by a lot on game 3, and I just... Uh, I just wanted to kill him fast, and I forced the kill, and then he caught up, and I was like, oh, wait. Now, one of the one of the, the things about this matchup as well, you know, Zero Suit Samus is a very light character. Uh, when Meta Knight's gliding towards Zero Suit Samus, uh, Zero Suit Samus can forward air to beat it. You know, the first hit clash, the second hit will hit Meta Knight. 
Uh, if, Met if Zeus was Samus jabs in Meta Knight, the first two hits will connect, then Meta Knight can just shield the third. It's just unfortunate property of her jab. Her jab's frame one, though. Yeah, frame so one that's jab. why it allows her to go from down smash to, to jab. You, you stop things like out of Beata Shield because it doesn't have doesn't have a full, you know, invincibility from the first two frames. It starts on... Oh, wow. That was so risky. Right. Oh, that guy yeah, should be the end of this. Oh. Oh, wow. Yeah, nice. Oh, and he can chain grab. Now he's getting that damage. Joe's really trying to break out. He knows it. Oh, oh, that DI. Oh, wow. Good shit, Joe. Joe played that well. As soon as uh, he tethered, he had no choice but to go up into Joe's Nair. Right. Or else, if he didn't, he it would just Nair again. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, the chain grab got messed up. You could have won off the chain grab. Yeah. Tech, that's what. I, that's why I said though. Turning nerves and technical errors occur. Like, turning nerves, man.